Damn, girl. <laughs> That's what I've been missing for real. That's the only thing you miss about me. What you, what you doing, baby? You know I don't do all that cousin shit. I know, but I mean, you know, since you miss me so much, I thought we could do it this one time. Uh, good. I'll be quiet. I'll work this out. Oh, yeah. Hello. Hey, sweetheart. Hey, babe. How you doing? I'm still good when we talked this morning. <laughs> what are you up to? Chilling with Taish. <laughs> oh, for real. Tell her to say hello. I'll tell her when she comes out of the bath. Okay. Do you need anything? I'm a little hungry. Do you mind if I get me and tie something to eat? Oh, no. Nah, go ahead. That's cool. Do you still have my car? Yes, I do. Okay, cool. cool. Do I have a spending limit? No, you don't have a spending limit. I just had to ask. <laughs> Alright, well, you go ahead and order your food. I hope you enjoy it, and I'll uh, talk to you later. Alright. Got you a real big time simp over there, don't you? Well, that simp about to get us something to eat. Shit. What yeah. you want to eat? Thank you. Some Chinese food would be good. Some Chinese food? Hey, yeah. yeah, baby, I want some fried eggs. Oh, that do sound good. Yeah, look at that. I got something else for you. Is that right? That's real right. Hello? Hey guys. How are you doing? Girl, you know me. Just living life. I feel you. What you got going on? Nothing, girl. Nah, I know who that's a lie. Why you say that? Cause you always got something going on. Well, I just came from Reggie's house, child. Reggie? Your ex Reggie? Yes. Girl, he must have some gold-plated dick or something because you just can't seem to leave him alone. <laughs> well, I hadn't talked to him in a while and he just randomly texted and said he wanted to see me. And you ran your happy ass up over there. Well, I wouldn't say I ran over there. I might have done a light jog. Well, what's up with you and Theo? Nothing really. Are y'all still together? Yeah, we still together. You must be tired of him. I mean, Theo, he a good dude. He just like too clingy and he too soft. Too soft? Yeah, he let me talk to him crazy. And he don't say nothing. He don't even try to check me. Well, what you want him to do? Well, sometimes I want him to tell me to sit down and shut the hell up. Be assertive. Mm, I feel that. I need a man to take charge. I can't stand no man with no backbone. Exactly. And Dio, he just don't do that. I mean, he treat me good and buy me anything I want. He has a lot of ambition and earning potential. I feel you. And plus, the sex is boring. I like to be choked and have my hair pulled when I'm not wearing a wig or weave. And Dio, he just ain't into any of that. He just wants to have basic sex. He actually asked me if he can do certain things to me sexually. What? Yeah, I'm like, nigga, if you don't just do that shit and let me tell you if I like it or not. Right. Well, look, continue fucking Reggie and get the money and the stability from Theo. And boom, there you go. Life too short to be unhappy. That part. Well, he's supposed to be coming over here, so I'm going to clean up a little bit. All right, girl. Bye. 
Okay. So, what would you rate yourself on a scale from one to ten without makeup? Um, without makeup, I would give myself a five. You know, without makeup. A five. You know, I'm going to have to just go ahead and be brutally honest with you. You're not going to find yourself that tall, attractive, six-figure earning man. You're not going to do it. My advice to you will be just to find yourself an average man. Well, I'm not going to settle for average. Well, why not? An average woman should be with an average man. I need somebody that's, you know, on my level. Are you listening to what you're saying right now? Yes, I hear what I'm saying. Some of you black women, it's just so delusional. I mean, what world are you living in? Oh, wow. Honestly, I can get any man I want. You can get any kind of man you want. Okay, so why don't you have a man now? Why did you call my show? Because I just wanted some advice. And I'm trying to give you my advice. But you're not being receptive to what I'm saying. You're not listening to me. I am listening. Lydia, I was speaking now. Well, I'm speaking to you. I mean, but you're not listening to me. You know what? See, that's what we're not going to do. You're not going to talk over me, okay? We're not. You're not going to talk over me. What? I feel like, I mean... <sighs> You are rude. Like, you're just mean. Okay, I'm being mean, and you're not listening to what I'm trying to tell you. So, you know what? You, you, if you think I'm being mean, let me show you how mean I can be. Have a good day. I don't know what she think this is. And good luck finding your six-figure man. What's up, sweetheart? Hey. My voice is on. Why you buy me this? You know I don't drink no white wine. Did you enjoy your meal early? Yeah, I did. Okay. Are you hungry now? A little bit. What you want to eat? I don't know. What about seafood? That sounds good. That's what we'll do. Okay. was supposed to be with you earlier. So, see what had happened was, I was with Reggie earlier, and then Dio called while I was with Reggie, and so I just told Dio I was with you. Reggie? Yeah. When you start back talking to him? Man, I ain't been talking to him in a minute, and then he just randomly texted me and said he wanted to see me. Wow. What? I just don't know why you can't leave him alone. I ain't even been messing with him, though. But you did today, and I know y'all smashed. Bitch. What? Man, don't judge me. I'm not judging you. I'm just a little bit confused. Confused about what? You got a good man. He'll do anything for you, anything to make you happy. You know how many women want to act like that? I know I do. But you can't seem to leave this nigga over here, though, who treats you like shit. That's what I'm confused about. Man, they are a good dude and all, but he just don't satisfy my needs. Does anybody satisfy you? What is that supposed to mean? I mean, I don't think there's anything or anyone that makes you happy. I don't know about all that. I do. I know you for years. And if you don't be careful, you're gonna be with a bunch end up with a bunch of cats running around here, like Kevin Simmons said. Man, whatever. I just want what I want when I want it. All right, I'm telling you. It's all good. You want something to drink? Girl, you know I want to drink. <laughs> I got you, girl.
What's up, Taisha? Hey, Theo. How you doing? I'm good. Okay. Thank you for meeting me out here. No problem. Well, you know I love Ebony. And, you know, with you being her best friend, I just thought it would be right if I talked to you first. Talk to me about what? I want to propose to Ebony. What do you think? I don't think that's a good idea. Why is that? Because Ebony's not ready to get married. You don't think Ebony's ready to get married or is it something else? I'm just going to be real with you. You're a good dude and you deserve a good woman. Uh-huh. And Ebony's not a good woman. Don't get me wrong. Ebony's my best friend and I know her well, but she's not she's not the woman for you you deserve a woman that's gonna appreciate and respect you and yeah I'm gonna just tell you something about us uh, we women we act right and do good for a man that we really want well I appreciate your honesty no problem I didn't expect the conversation to go this way <laughs> Sorry, I had to be honest with you. Hmm. I guess it's a good thing I didn't buy the ring already. Yeah. Hmm. Well, I gotta go. Okay. See you later. All right. I'm gonna ask you something. Don't be lying, neither. What is it, baby? What are we doing? What are we doing? Like, what are we doing? Like, are we working on getting back together? <laughs> what? We just having fun. Huh? What you mean, just having fun? Yeah, we just having fun. So I'm good enough to have sex with, but I'm not good enough to be in a relationship with. I can't say all that. What I'm saying is, when you're in a relationship, titles and all that, it complicates things, and I don't want that. That sounds like bullshit to me. Listen, you know who I am. You know what type of guy I'm. In. It's the reason why we're not in relationships right now because you know I'm not the relationship type. And besides, ain't you already in a fucking relationship? First of all, our relationship didn't work because you couldn't keep your dick out of other females. No, no. The reason why our relationship did not work is because I got tired of constantly trying to please you and you're fucking unpleasable. And if you want to know the real reason why, that's the real reason. I got tired of that shit. And that's it. Whatever, I'm out of here. Fuck out of here. Man. Oh, whatever. You'll be back. No, I won't. I'll see your ass later. No, you won't. Yeah, I will. No, you won't. See you later. Bye. 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 Okay, oh, hello, ma'am. Hello, Kelvin. Uh, what's your first name? Sharika. Okay, Miss Sharika. Um, how old are you? Twenty-five. Twenty-five. Okay, I'm thirty-five. <laughs> okay. Uh, what's your dress size? A six. Six. Sixteen. All right. You uh, got any kids? Yes. How many? Six. Okay, um, how many fathers? Six. All right, six fathers. Um, were you married to any of the fathers? No. Okay, all right, so let me ask you, so what exactly are you looking for? What do, what do, you, what do you want? I'm looking for a high-value man that's going to take care of me and my kids. Okay, looking for a high-value man that can take care of you and your kids. Um... Okay. Are you looking for a relationship or just somebody to take care of you and your kids? Both of them. All right, then. Um, well, let me ask you this. So, what is it that you bring to the table in the relationship? I look good. I have a nice body and some fire-ass vibes, period. Okay. Well, let me ask you this. Can you cook? No. Okay. Well, can you clean? Sometimes. Let me get this straight. You are a 35-year-old woman with six kids 
about six different baby daddies who can't cook and you clean sometimes and you actually want a high value man yes so what's your advice for me my advice to you is actually you, you just get yourself a dog as a matter of fact get you two or three dogs because you will not find yourself a high value man oh why not why not D did you hear yourself no high value man is gonna put up with all the stuff that you got going on only thing you bring to the table is your box and it, it, it ain't even fresh right now. It's tainted. You actually need to close the box down. Your box is what's got you in the situation you're in. The box and brought a lot of trouble to you. Let me tell you something. You know what? No, uh-uh. Let me tell you something. Have a good day. Oh. <sighs> Listen. Hold on. I know he did not. He did. How you doing, sweetheart? Hey. I wanted to uh, talk to you. Talk to me about what? Our relationship. What about it? Where do you see it going? I don't know. Do you see a future with me? I mean, I guess. Do you even want to be in a relationship with me? Where are all these questions coming from? I'm just curious. I don't feel like answering these questions right now. Well, I hope one day you find that one person that makes you happy. Take care of yourself. We make a lot of money that way, but you know, it just depends. Hey, stranger. Hey, let me call you back. Hey, how you doing? I'm good. How you doing? I'm good. I'm good. What you been up to? Just working. That's the only thing I do. Ah, uh, okay. What about you? The same. Okay. You still work for the bank? Yeah, but I just got my real estate license, so I just signed with an agency. Congratulations. I'm happy for you. Thank you. You still doing IT work? Uh, yes. I just started with the new company making a whole lot more money, so I'm excited about that. Well, congratulations to you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Well, how about we go celebrate and it's my treat. Right. Hey, babe. Hey, how you doing, babe? I'm doing so good. Mm. Let me introduce you to somebody. Okay. Monet, this is Ebony. Ebony, this is Monet, my fiance. Good seeing you too. Take care of yourself. Oh, I missed you today. I missed you too. How was your day? You smell good. Oh, thank you. It was good. I just feel you a little bit. Had a little couple auditions to do. That's good to hear. Feel good about it. Good. Just wanted us to go walk in okay. and enjoy the day. All Let's right. go. Dang, I messed up. Dang, man, I messed up. <laughs>